Hi friends, this is a case of fractured instrument in the distal root of the lower left first molar tooth and the same tooth has ledges in the mesial canals as well. This particular case is a little more challenging because half of the instrument is already beyond the apex in the distal canal and the canal is wider as well. So trying to retrieve the instrument may lead to the instrument to slip beyond the apex and removal of the temporary materials we can see the file in the distal canal but not very clearly and there were some GP material also beside the instrument and we enlarged the coronal portion of the canal little wider so that we can see the instrument more clearly after doing this we created some space around the fractured file with the help of u -file. now we have to vibrate the fractured instrument in a counterclockwise manner with the help of u -file. but this is a challenging task because we are seeing the fractured instrument and using the u -file in a microscope that also in a indirect vision mirror view seeing in a mirror view doing a clockwise manner around a tiny instrument using another tiny instrument is really challenging sometimes we go in wrong direction that's why see i can do uh, some trials outside the canal and again i try to repeat inside the canal this is how we can do it without much damage to the canals this is a very important challenge in terms of file retrieval after continuous counterclockwise uh, motion of vibration with the u file the file has become little looser now it is not so firm as in the beginning now the file has moved from the buccal side to middle portion of the canal and also it is little bit shifted from the deepest portion to a little coronal portion but still the file is uh, firm and it is not dancing stage it is not I mean it is not so easily moving so again we try to tease the file with the help of u file now the file is moving uh, we usually call it dancing stage now the file is uh, very loose inside the canal but it is not coming out and I found that a little bit portion in the coronal segment has got a bulge that, and that portion uh, is the hindrance for the file to come out easily so it blocks the way so I just removed the tiny part which has got a little bulge now the way for the file to come out is clear now it can easily slip out sometimes this kind of uh, hindrance may be there for any file which is already loose inside and it is uh, moving very freely but it cannot come out for a tease with the tiny instrument means we have to see if there is any uh, such uh, hindrances for the file if so we have to clear it off so that the file can easily slip out now you can see as uh, uh, as the hindrance is cleared now the file is uh, freely uh, slipping out with the tease of a tiny instrument after this we cleared the ledges from the mesial canals as well then routine cleaning and shaping uh, has been done after that obturation is completed and this tooth is given a full coverage crown